The New York Yankees. The we are at the 26th pick in the 2023 MLB draft. I want to thank our friends at Game Time. Download the Game Time app, create an account, use promo code Locked in MLB for twenty dollars off your first purchase. Last minute tickets, lowest price guaranteed. With the 26th pick in the 2023 MLB draft, the New York Yankees take George Lombard Jr., the shortstop out of Gulliver Prep High School in Florida. 6'3", 190, uh, good size for a shortstop. Question for me uh, is is really going to be on Lombard. Um, <clears throat> uh, it, can he, size-wise, can he stick at shortstop? Is he going to have to kick? Uh, he has the arm to handle the left side of the in- left side of the infield but is it second base is it third base is it left field but i think the bat's really good and i think ultimately that's what matters uh the yankees have shown they're not afraid of a questionable fit at uh, at with an arm at shortstop you look look at volpe his arm isn't fantastic but he's making it work uh ever since he had chicken parm with austin wells he's a much better hitter at the major league level now and so george lombard jr hit tool here What's the power ceiling like defensively? Where does he play? But I think either way, he's young for the class. He kind of fits an age-based model, and it feels like it's going to be pretty good here. Yeah, he's 24th on my board, and they got him at 26. So that that's that's how I you know where I see it. And as you mentioned, two of those fun indicators are bloodlines and age. He didn't turn 18 until June. And he's another kid who like um, Namala is, is kind of a willowy guy, but like you look at a lot of the data around him. I, I said he could have double plus power. Maybe I was being a little too uh, on that, a little too plus on him, but uh, I did, wouldn't have put him at 24. It just, he's, he's already hitting the ball hard. He's a big kid. He's either 6'3 or 6'4. I, I thought he's going to probably be an outfielder, but yeah, he, it's a bet on power. It's, it's a, after taking Spencer Jones last year and Austin Wells the year before that, uh, they've, they've been on a power kick. And, you know, it's a, Another guy to add to that. And if he can stick it short, great. You know, you always run him out there and see what, what can happen first. Yeah, and honestly, look at what Oswaldo Cabrera's done. He, I mean, if, if he's a good enough shortstop, he can play almost anywhere. <laughs> I mean, he can play. Cabrera's played just about everywhere. He even got reps at first base last year when, when Rizzo was questionable, like during batting practice and things like that. So obviously could be just about anywhere. 